Welcome back. This is still Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. And yes, you know how we do it on the show. You never know what's going to come up. So yes, we have a surprise guest for you. Our guest is an artist signed to Fino's Penthouse. He is a connoisseur of words. Before he got signed in 2019, he used to be known as Kyle B, which is going to have to tell us why he chose that name, because I think it's a terrible choice. Okay, he featured on the Lamy Days 999 album and the song titled EM Space with the rest of the Penthouse Crew. His debut track with Penthouse Jekka Soro Blue Mind. He is a chemical engineering graduate from Obafemi Awolowo University. His latest single, Satisfied, was produced by the Dangerous Mastercraft and is doing great numbers with just a published visual directed by Unlimited LA. He intends to release his EP called Razor July Todd, which is tomorrow, by the way, people. Ladies and gentlemen, let's make welcome the Superboy Check. Hello, everybody. Welcome. <laughs> What's good? I'm good, man. Kyle B. Hmm. Sounds like RDP. <laughs> I didn't even see that coming. <laughs> so Kyle B, why why that name? <clears throat> let's let's start with that. Your friend gave it to me, honestly. Mm -hmm. Like when I wanted to start. So like, it wasn't like, it wasn't your choice. It was not me. It was not. Because I was wondering, like, come on, which Kyle there, B. There was one particular day I went somewhere. Then they said it was like Sky B. They, they said there's somebody before. Yeah, Nigeria Sky B and you know, all the yeah. <laughs> so um, tell us about your music and why you think we should tilt towards that. Because I listen to a few of your songs and they are not your everyday kind of music. Mm. They are actually kind of different. They have this trap feel. They have this Afro feel. They have the soul. They have the R and B all merged in one. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Um, tell us what your style really is and why we should tilt towards that. Oh yeah, you said it half of it to the end. Naturally, is is and I call it Afro fusion, mm. trap, R and B. Originally, that's why I you know I mm. fall into. So now I bring it down to my country, you know, to, for understanding. That's the basic part of music. So Afro fusion, uh, fusing with Afro is the major part of my music. So inside my music, you hear a lot of trap, but then you're hearing it in your countries you know, mm. kind of way. That's so what would you call your genre? Afrofusion. Afro Afrofusion. Yes. All right, great. Mm. Amazing. I'm more interested in your name. Can you tell us the story behind Superboy? Boy check. check. First of all, I'm a, I'm a badass guy. Okay. You know, so that's the Superboy mm. part. Then the check parts, you know, it came from, you know, saying the first time I wanted to freestyle somewhere, I didn't know what to say. So I was like, my check, my check. My, I, I went on for like 20 times. So it goes, it's talked to me like this guy that says check too much. Ooh. You get what I'm saying? Like, mm. like this guy, check, that check guy don't come. So when I, when I started performing in school, they started to say, everybody scream check mm. because they knew me, you know, from there. So, you know, and you know, that's how. All right, so that's speaking of checks, how is the check coming in now? I'm like, it? fine, fine. That's, I'm looking for that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, okay, so you yeah. signed to Fino Fino, of yeah, course. Yeah. So um, what's that journey like for you? Because we know Fino, Fino has been making good music, especially indigenous music. Mm -hmm. So one would, would have thought that maybe you would be signing artists with indigenous sound, but your sound is um, something we can all vibe to. So how has that journey been for you and how is it working with Fino? Well, it's a very special kind of thing because I admired, I admired him when, before I met him, I used to love his music a lot, his rap was very special, like mm -hmm. I thought it was fantastic. So when, when I got to meet him and he was interested, I was, I was so happy, like, I couldn't believe it because of exactly what he said right now, mm -hmm. like, you know, he's into indigenous music, but he's, he's very vast in listening to music, mm -hmm. he's not restricted. You know, it's also a very dope rapper in yeah, English. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. A lot of people vast. don't know that, but it's very vast. So I think that's how we connected naturally to to ourselves. So you know, it's I loved it. I love it. I loved it when I met him. I love it now. I so what are some it. of the benefits of your contract with Fino? Does he come with a car, a house, twenty million naira, fifty million naira? You know, let's give us the juicy details. Well, I'm not going to say anything. I'm not going to go into detail. But it's just vibes. I love it. You know. It's called yeah. tea time. You should spill some tea, brother. <laughs> it, it's you know it's just vibes, but you know there are plenty of things which you can see. If, you know, if I'm not looking fly, you're gonna know. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's the. All right. So before we brought you into the studio, we were talking about Tua Savage and Yemi and Ade. Oh. So now I'm going to ask you this question: Kiss, date, or marry? Tua Savage, Yemi Alade, Shay Shay. A kiss. Tua Savage. Mm-hmm. Our date, Tua Savage. <laughs> okay. And I'm married to Tua Savage. 
Oh yeah. So, okay. okay. Yeah, okay. No, no, that's a different <laughs> answer for that. Yeah. Okay, but but really, you have okay, to like peak like. Yeah. Okay, yeah. You have to die. Definitely, I'll date. I'll date Shay Shay. Mm -hmm. I'll marry Yemiela Day. And I'll kiss Tuasa. Wow, I'll tell you, marry Tuasa because I would have married. No, Tuasa is too hot. Like you know, like. A lot of times she's... That marriage might not work yeah. out. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a choice. Okay, so I noticed that you're from Oye. Oh, yeah. What was your fondest memory from Oye? That memory you cannot forget about that school. Uh, I, would, I, would say, I would say it's transforming from chemical engineering to music. Because mm. it happened in school. Like, I can't forget been always reading my books every day mm. every single day you know transforming from that point to n forgetting that i have to read and doing music every day inside the same school you mm. know what I'm saying? like it was pretty hard for me because i always love to read mm. then the moment the, the, my head you know before I, twinkle it's gone mm. now nah, i can't stop thinking about music you know that period was a very you know Difficult yes. period, so I always right. remember. Okay, so if you could feature with one Nigerian artist, just hmm. one Nigerian artist all over the world, one Nigerian artist, who will it be? Right now? Yes. Can I count people that have featured me before? No. Somebody that you have not had that any feature with. You would love to, that you, that you know if I feature, feature this person, I'm blown. Whiskey. I knew Everybody. it. This is great. I knew it was going to be. Okay, so if you could have any superpower, what would it be? Be invisible. Wow. That's smart. And why would you be invisible? Well, as it is. A lot of people think they can walk into a bank and the money will not be invisible. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know, I know, but in, I like being. I don't want anybody to see me doing mm. my shit. I don't want anybody to see me oh, around yeah. my game. Yeah. Oh, I'll right. just be like. All right, so we're actually running out of time. How good are you at freestyling? Well, I don't, I don't know. But you, you're quite good at freestyle because we haven't touched on your EP, so I'd like you to sign us out by telling us about your EP, In a okay. Freestyle. In a Freestyle? Yeah. Hmm. Razor, cut that shit. You know cuss words, sorry. Oh, oh, no, cause, oh, oh. Yeah. I don't know how to start from there. I just want to talk about my EP. All right, so I just talk about your EP I real quick. Uh, my EP is uh, five songs. Mm. I call it Razor EP. So I have, on the EP, I diversity, it. You know, I, you know, I, I touch different genres of music, from trap to Afrobeat, you know. So mm. it's, it's something that is not for one person, it's for everybody. Mm. Mm. You know, that's why the EP is, that's why I love the EP. That's why the EP is coming out, too. The whole country, you know, and I, you know, I expect and believe everybody should really enjoy it. Like All right, so that's tomorrow. What time exactly should we be expecting 12. tomorrow? Twelve noon. Yes. Amazing stuff. So before, just sign us out on the show, you know, real quick, and just give us a quick freestyle. When they trying to hold me, I go zoom zoom zoom. Don't like your vibe, and I go zoom zoom zoom. Blowing up the roof, and it go boom boom boom. Don't you ever treat me like I be moon moon. Bad energy, I zoom zoom zoom. I'll be on my way like I'll be coming soon. Got a chopper on and it go boom, boom, boom. So when they try to hold me, I go zoom, zoom, zoom. Right, thank wow, you so it. much. Boy, and when time is, and when we're having fun, time definitely goes zoom, yeah. zoom, zoom. Yeah, yeah, Sadly, yeah, yeah. So we have to go. Thank you for watching. Join the conversation on social media with the hashtag Tea Time or tweet at us at Plus TV Africa. Remember, you can catch up on this episode and all our exclusive content by subscribing to our YouTube channel at Plus TV Africa. You can also watch Tea Time on Outer TV and in London on Ben Television. My thank you, as always, will go to my co anchor. Nimi they can be and of course our studio guests check yeah. and the entire production team for their amazing contribution thank you for watching plus tv africa's tea time i am ifel washington saying stay safe <laughs>